All right, fruit lovers. Today we're looking at the Indian blood freestone peach. And what I mean by blood peach is that you can see that red coloration there that they get. And if you're really good at growing fruit and you live in a much better climate than my own, you can grow blood peaches with red all throughout them. Now what this red coloration does, like other fruits, is the color usually corresponds to a particular flavor. So if we have this red, this red coloration here in a peach, well, it's actually giving it kind of a raspberry flavor. So if you took a peach, injected it with raspberry, this is what you'd get. Now the white peaches are kind of sub-acid, low acid, and really just sweet. The yellow peaches have a nice balance. This, in my opinion, is like a combination of the both with that raspberry flavor. I think you have to grow it. If you have any space for another fruit tree, get yourself a blood peach. They ripen rather late as well. Um, I do struggle a lot with brown rot because we get a lot of plum cucurlio damage. Uh, the plum cucurlio eventually comes in, creates these spots here on the, uh, on the peaches, creates wounds, and then that's where the brown rot gets in there. So, you know, it's uh, something you probably are going to want to spray. Um, you know, my plums are really difficult to grow. This peach historically has been very difficult to grow. I've got some decent ones down here but I think getting them off the tree a little bit earlier is gonna probably be your best bet. But the problem is the longer you let them ripen, the better your fruit quality, the better the color is gonna be and the better that berry flavor is gonna be. So it's kind of a problem. It's kind of a conundrum, but certainly here, even without spraying, I'm able to get some decent ones every year. I think it does take a little bit for your tree to get mature, the size up. That definitely helps fight some of this uh, stuff that's trying to get at it and ruin the quality of our fruits but generally i think this is one of the best stone fruits i've ever eaten uh would highly recommend it so thanks for watching this one guys we'll see you for the next video hit the like button for me hit the subscribe button grow yourself some blood peaches